Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Animate tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to change the direction of a gradient, or I'm going to change the direct, or the angle, pardon me, of your gradient. What am I talking about? I'm talking about this is a default gradient. It goes from blue to green, and this is goes left, basically, to right. But in a lot of cases, you don't want that. Here is another example where the gradient goes top down or bottom up, depending on which way you look at it. I'm going to show you how to make that change. Okay, let's start with a new document. I'm going to go File, New, and then I'm just going to create an HD 1280 by 720. Regular stuff. Doesn't really matter what size it is. That's not the point. I'm now going to go up here, and I'm going to change the window size. So I'm, going to sit this, I'm going to set this to fit in window, so the whole thing is shown. Okay, good. If you're still following along, I'm going to just click on a new layer. And this is the layer we're going to work on. So we've got a second layer here. You can double click on it and call it gradient if you want to. Up to you. Doesn't matter too much, but let's do it anyway for best practices. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to left click on the rectangle tool here. And then I'm just going to drag out a rectangle. And it's already pre-selected the fill, which is a gradient fill for me. If you don't see that though, let me show you how to do this. You want to go up here to the top right under color and then when you click on color and if you don't see that go to window and just make sure that color has a check mark beside it. But if you don't see color, go there to color now and then here. Make sure that it's set to linear gradient. When it's done then you'll see these, this option here to go ahead and double click on these and you can change the colors of the gradient. So you could instead of having green you can make it whatever, something like that. It doesn't matter. That is an option, so I'm just going to do that. But anyways, I'm going to go back to work here. Oop, I'm going to click out of that. And now I want to change the direction of this gradient. This is the most important part. So anyways, what you want to do now, and this is not immediately apparent because the old version of Animate had the gradient tool embedded underneath this tool here, which is the free transform tool. It no longer does, at least in this version, what you need to do is you want to go down to the bottom here, double click on edit toolbar, which are these three dots, left click on that, pardon me, and when you do that, you're going to get a new tool. And one of the tools that you can select is the gradient transform tool. I'm going to left click on that and I am just going to drag it and you're going to see that I can drop it somewhere. So I'm just going to drop it right here. And when I do that and I close it and I just click out, you're going to see now that I have the gradient transform tool, which is what we want left click on that so it's selected now go up to the top here just I want to go to about 50 percent because I need to be able to see a little bit better and now I'm just gonna left click on the on the pasteboard here and you're gonna see here that when I left click on it I have some options in particular I can rotate it and I can increase or decrease the size so let's go ahead and decrease the size first just so I can show you a little bit better and now I'm going to rotate it top to bottom. So I'm just pulling and presto. This is now a top to bottom or bottom to top gradient. And if I want to increase the size out like this, or if I want to make it really sharp, you can do that just like that. If I want to have it on an angle, maybe I want it to go on a nice 45 degree angle or something like that, something cool like that. Easy to do, guys. That is how you do it. The F key, add in the gradient transform tool. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned. Be back soon.